Yeah, I've always had that passion for the club, being a foundation member and a fan every single year. Got to march through the streets of Parramatta with the RBB and of course being a ball boy, being close to the action has only made me want to play for the club even more. Um, got to throw balls to guys like Hef and Michael Beecham who are now our 20s coaches and one memory that sticks out was, it was a pretty scary memory. I was too slow to throw the ball in one time and Topol Stanley started yelling at me and I was just a little kid and yeah, pretty scary moment that one, but it was funny. Well, it came as a came as a surprise. Um, I wasn't wasn't I was training all week, expecting to play on the weekend with Dylan in the MPL, and he called me up Thursday night, told me to check if my passport was valid, and I, I didn't know because I've never had to use it before, never been overseas. So when I got the call up, I was just very excited and very grateful for the opportunity. Yeah, it was a taste of the life that I want to live. So it was very exciting. I was just like a little kid in a candy store, pretty much. My eyes lit up. Yeah, there's a there's a lot of experienced experienced boys in that first team, and they they were very they were very supportive. And straight after the game, you know, they just lost 3-1, and they the first thing they did was congratulate me. So to have guys that I look up to do that do that and give that congratulations to me it meant a lot. Yeah, well, my goal hasn't it hasn't changed since I joined the club back in late 2015. My goal has always to, been to progress through the academy up the ranks and eventually sign a contract with the first team and Wellington was just a small taste of that and yeah, still got a lot of hard work to do to achieve that goal.